shapes. Square, triangle, rectangle, circle. This is a square. A square has four sides. One, two, three, four. And a square has four corners. One, two, three, four. This is a triangle. A triangle has three sides. One, two, three. And a triangle has three corners. One, two, three. This is a rectangle. A rectangle has four sides. One, two, three, four. And a rectangle has four corners. One, two, three, four. It has four sides and four corners like a square, but it has two sides that are longer. This is a circle. It has no sides and no corners. A circle is just a curve going around. Here we have some shapes. Orange squares, blue rectangles, green triangles, and red circles. And here we have a mat. And we can put these shapes onto the mat where they belong. We have an orange square. And we can put it into a square shape. What would go here? That's a triangle. We can put a green triangle there. Look, here we have another square. We can put a square there. And what would go here? That's a circle. We can put a red circle there. Here we have a, do you know, a rectangle. We can put a blue rectangle there. Here we have a triangle. We can put one of our green triangles there. Here we have another rectangle. We can put another blue rectangle there. Do you know what that is? If you said circle, you're right. We can put a red circle there. And this one? If you said triangle, you were right. We could put a green triangle there. What about this one? Square. We can put a square there. And this one? Blue rectangle. That's a rectangle. And this one? That's a square. We put the square in the shape. And this one? Do you know what this one is? If you said circle, you're correct. And this one? That's a triangle. We can put a green triangle there. And what about this one? We can put this blue rectangle there. It's a rectangle. And the last one, well, we only have one shape left. It must be this one. We can see it has no sides or corners. It has curves. Just like this picture, it's a circle. We've matched all the shapes to the shapes on the mat. 
Here we have a picture of a pine tree. It's made from one, two, three triangles and a rectangle for the tree trunk. We can put these three triangles and this rectangle onto the picture to make a pine tree. We have this small triangle that fits here. We have a medium-sized triangle. It's larger than the first triangle, and it's smaller than this triangle. We can put this triangle here. Then we have this much bigger triangle. It's larger than this triangle or this triangle. We can put it down here. And here, we have a rectangle, a brown rectangle, that we can put here as the tree trunk, and we've made a pine tree. Here we have a picture of a snowman. And the snowman is made of three circles, one, two, three, a triangle for his nose, and a rectangle and square for his hat. We can take these shapes and put them on the picture. We have our square and rectangle that make the hat, and we can put it on top of the head like that. We have a small circle for his head, and we can put it here. And we can put the orange triangle on his face for his nose. And this is a medium-sized circle. It's bigger, larger than the head circle. We can put it here for his body. And this circle is larger than the head and the body circle. It's the largest. It's the biggest. We can put it here. And we've made a snowman. Here we have a picture of a house. The house has a triangle for the roof, a square for the shape of the house, squares for windows, a rectangle for the door, and a circle for the doorknob. We can take a square, triangle, more squares, a rectangle, and make a house just like this one. We can put a square here, and we can put this rectangle on top, like a roof. We can put these squares here, like the windows. And we have a rectangle for a door with a circle for a doorknob. And we've made a house just like this one. We made the house with squares, rectangle, circle, and triangle. Square, triangle, rectangle, circle.